The Bible said that God spoke to Moses and said, I want you to build me five cities and they're going to be called cities of refuge. And these cities will be geographically established in Israel so that wherever people are, if they hurt or accidentally kill someone or if they murder someone and they don't deserve, it was an accident, it was manslaughter. Well, under the old law, it was an eye for an eye and you had the right if you were blood kin to go kill that person, even if it was an accident because they had done wrong to your blood. This is all in, in Numbers chapter 35. He said, put big gates on the city and leave them unlocked 24 hours a day. If they can just get to the city of refuge and enter in by choice through the gates and live in the city of refuge, the blood avenger cannot touch them there. And the law said that the blood avenger could slide up to the gate. You can hear his feet as they run up to the gate and slide in the sand, but he could not come inside because you had entered into the city of refuge, a place of safety, a place of comfort, a place of protection. The children were safe there. The Bible said our God is a refuge. He is a very present help in the time of trouble. And so here we are in guilt and judgment and the law says we deserve to die. We deserve judgment. But if we will run to our city of refuge, His name is Jesus Christ. And you can choose Him. You can choose life. You can choose grace. You can choose forgiveness. You can choose a new life. And if you would run to Him, He will in no wise cast you out. Come on run into the city of refuge that it's an awesome thing but there was one disadvantage to the city of refuge it still had a gate and at the front of that gate of the city of refuge the same gate that you made the choice to enter in was the same gate that you could exit if you chose to and if you went outside the gate then you were no longer protected and you were no longer safe this is a real warning to us today in a good way that once you enter into Christ be careful that you don't slip back into the old life he brought you out of you have the choice you make your choices and your choices make you and it doesn't matter how long you've lived in the city of refuge you better stay in the city come into Christ come into the church Come into the place of prayer. Come into His righteousness. You enter in by choice into His holiness. You're in a refuge. You're in a place of security.